Hello, my name is Adam Ratcliffe and I'm a member of the Data School's 23rd cohort at the Information Lab. In this video, we're going to have a look at custom date formats so you can change the way that your dates are presented in Tableau. Let's get started. We're going to look at custom date format. So if we go ahead and grab order date, right click and drag up to columns and do continuous quarters down here. So just one above month. And then let's put profit in again, why not? So we're not going to touch this side here because we've done our number formats on the previous tab. We're going to go ahead and go down here for quarter of order date, back up to format here, and here on the dates. So what we're going to look at. So there are a lot more options here in the dates menu because there are a lot more ways to display a date. So standard long date is that standard long date with the number of the day of the month, the month, and then the year. Standard short date is that standard written date with the slashes in between. You can choose from many different formats in this list. And the main thing to remember is that if you want to do your own format, just like in the number format section, click on the one that's closest to what you want and then go to custom. And it'll appear in that format. What I want to do is because we have it in quarters here, I would like it to have I'll, instead of saying 2018 Q1, I would like it to say Q1-18. So Q1 for 18, and then all the way up to Q4-21. So there doesn't seem to be anything closer in this menu than 2001 Q1. So we're going to hit that, go to custom. Okay. And in here, we can see that Q1 is written by uh, uppercase Q in quotes, and then a smaller case Q. So we know what we want that, and we know we want it at the front. So let's get rid of the four years, and let's put that there. Let's put our apostrophe in. We can just put that in as usual. And we want just this, the two last numbers of the year. And usually it's pretty intuitive. That's just going to be two Ys. Two Ys for year, and there you go. You get your 18. If that was four Ys, it would get the full year it would get 2018, but I just wanted it to be 18. The best way to use custom date formats is to find the one closest to what you want and then edit it to be what you want. So if we wanted a more complicated example, this has time in it as well. So we see this, it has day slash month slash year, hours, minutes, seconds, AM, PM. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned more about custom date formats. If you'd like to learn more about custom number formats, check out this video here.